The first ever over-the-counter birth control is now on store shelves. Good evening, I'm Amaya Kuznicki and is off tonight. The pill does not require a prescription to buy it. News 10's Jordan Burrell investigates. It's a historic moment and extremely exciting to see Opil on the shelves. Opil's launch means that now we have the first ever over-the-counter birth control pill. Opils are now being sold at major retailers, and doctors say it's a big stepping stone for women. Women have been using birth control pills for decades. Um, they know how to read a medication label, to weigh the pros and cons for themselves. Um, and to take a daily medication, so this is not new. Opil isn't a new medication. It has been available as prescription birth control for 50 years. Last year, it was finally considered safe enough for over-the-counter use. And that's especially important for folks who might face barriers to getting a prescription. So it can be expensive to take the time off work, to travel, to have to visit a doctor. Folks might not have a doctor. They have childcare, they have work, they have school, right? So this is a really important way to more easily and more directly access birth control pills. For one month supply of pills, it will cost people about $20. Most insurance plans cover prescription birth control, making it free for most. But now that it's over the counter, we're in uncharted territory. We need insurance coverage so that folks who have insurance can use their insurance to pay for this over the counter pill. And we also need low cost and no cost access. Opil's parent company will be offering a cost assistance program that will be available in the coming weeks. In Lansing, I'm Jordan Burrell, News 10. The pill is currently only being sold at major retailers like CVS and Walgreens.